Okay, today we're recording Knocking on Heaven's Door on GarageBand. Uh, so we create a new track. We'll start with our ever faithful drums, just to give us a beat and a time. And it's the same old classic rock drum beat. Got to change a few things this time though. Because it's such a slow song, we have to change the tempo. And you can just tap the tempo. So you get to, to about the right tempo that you like for this song. It's pretty slow. That sounds about right. Next thing is we don't want an electronic drum sound, so we might go for the retro rock drum pattern and record one bar of that. Okay, and then it's the same as before. Um, it's already right size, but I'm going to increase it to 16 bars for this song. And then loop it out. And then we add our next part, which is our chords. Um, introduces the new chord here, so we've got a C. G, D minor chord, so it starts on the D, then C, G, F, as you can see on your music there, C, G, D minor, D minor, C, G, F, F, and I'll just change a few things back there by accident. Okay, so we will get back to our keyboard, grand piano. Okay, so let's try that. It's the same chord progression, but it's an eight bar chord progression. D minor chord. And that's all we need. Um, for our chords because it's the rest is just looping it out so we're going to quantize that first so that um, we're in time we will use eighth notes for that and then loop it out let's try record our bass sound well this is easier on the keyboard first off same notes let's go G, D, C, G, and F, and that's all we need. I might change it to a bass sound now though. If we go to other, and then the rock there, you can have any of these basses. Let's go for a P bass, see what that sounds like. Mm, sounds a bit bad. Let's go for the Liverpool rock sound like the Beatles. Loop it out. Quantize it. And you might not be able to hear it that well because the piano is so loud. And you can adjust your volumes in there. Great. Now all we need is the melody, so it's the verse melody first, followed by the chorus. They're very similar. Only two notes in it. Um, again, we change back to our piano sound, although you can use any sound you want. So there's only those three notes. Let's see how we go with the melody. Again. Just follow the words. And the chorus.
Okay. Just finish that one thing here with the quantizing. We would go to 16th notes because we're at such a slow tempo. And that should be the whole thing. And then the chorus. And that's it.